You're welcome back. You're watching the news on Galaxy TV. Now, for more updates and latest news, visit our website at www.galaxytvonline.com or subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtube.com forward slash Galaxy TV Nigeria. You can follow and interact with us on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash Galaxy TV or treat it as at Galaxy TV. Now, don't forget to follow and tag us on our Instagram page at official Galaxy TV. Our social media platforms are user-friendly and can always accommodate your live update and comment. Now, in a bid to bridge the gap and challenge age-long myth surrounding branding and marketing, as well as perceptions about the business of advertising, public relations and management of the sales process, a journalist with bias towards brands and marketing reportage, Ikem Oku, has formally unveiled a book titled Pitch debunking marketing's strongest mates in Lagos. Judith Irenwa was there and tells us more. The 187-page book explores certain strongly held views and trends in the wider marketing world in the context of the relevance and impacts in the realities of everyday efforts to facilitate exchange in Nigeria. With the aim of straightening some age-long perceptions about the advertising and public relations business in the country. The author, Ikem Okuhu, hopes the book will spur leaders in the industry to document the unique experiences in the sector for the benefit of all stakeholders. Leaders of this industry into documenting a lot of the exciting activities that take place in the Nigerian marketing. We cannot continue to go outside to borrow experiences when we have them in abundance here. Reviewer of the book, Emeka Okwara, says, though the author raised lots of dust in the book, he went further to preferring solutions to the problems. He noted that the liberal uses of local case studies in Nigeria will be of immense benefits to marketing practitioners as well as students. He's filled in a space that will open the marketing uh, industry. We need more books, we need books, we need books, we need books. He's done it. There is nothing better than when you have experience and knowledge and you can share it with people. So generations yet unborn can benefit from your knowledge and experience. That's what he has done. And it's a very good job he has done. Excellent book. At least I have read it twice to be able to review it. It's a great book, something for every student of marketing, in need of, of communication. Practitioners will find it very interesting. There's a lot to learn. There's a lot to excite them, to make them try to find, you know, understand what they do every day. I mean, um, I'm not going to argue with Ikem so much about some of his issues. Yes, he raised some silent issues. He's right in most cases. Many things are going south, as you know. But I think the marketing industry is challenged now. A guest at the event and the renowned author, Richard Akinola, held Ikem Okuhu for a job well done and urged you to to develop reading culture. It's not easy to, <laughs> to write a book. I've been in this book business since uh, 1989 when I wrote my first book. I've written about 16 books now, and it's not that easy. So it's a very commendable thing, and because uh, the book is, uh, the, uh, the research is quite painstaking, I mean, in terms of the prose, wonderful. So I think it, it needs to be commended and correlated for this effort. Well, it, it's a major challenge we have <clears throat> in our hands because mostly now we have an uh, Instagram generation who are not so much interested about reading, about history, about, um, about uh, analytical discussion. So, and that's why it's important we cannot stop writing books. I mean, irrespective of uh, uh, the challenges we have in terms of uh, um, how social media had um, taken that particular aspect away from today's youth. The 12th chapter book explores topics like building generational brand, globalization is a lie, among others. The book launch was a double celebration as it marked the wedding anniversary of the Okuhus. Judith Renoir for Galaxy News, Lagos.